I'm Sébastien Chaboche, Regional Category Manager in Europe and CIS for Palatability. Previously, I was Business Manager France, mainly focused on palatability business, and I've worked for more than 20 years in renowned nutrition. Natural feed behavior is the key. From far away, cows make choices in what nature offers, and it results in natural selection. To preserve their health, cows must discriminate feed, helping by their nose and their mouth and their health sensation. Palatability is determined by the acceptance. Globally, from the worst to the best, cows reject bitterness and sour, and they accept salty and sweety. But we should differentiate smell and taste. Smell comes first and taste second. In the nature, toxic plants and substances develop their bad taste and cows have adapted to avoid poisoning. In cow's nutrition, feed is complementary. If the animal doesn't hit the amount planned, ration will be unbalanced and the production degraded. Around that, we have critical physiological period in which feed intake and production capability are reduced. Last, in robot milking system, feed intake and attractiveness of the feed are key points. In heat stress period, ruminants move less and eat less. These have a direct link to milk production, so palatability could help to control the reduction of the feed intake. We recently studied the effect of our solution Gusty Plus in robot making system. Average daily refusal increased by 24% and milk yield increased by 1.9 kg as soon as Gusty Plus was added to the feed. If you need more information about palatability and animal feed behavior, please contact me on LinkedIn or on adiseo.com. Bye!